it works. works. What works. we need is a digital stethoscope that one allows us to listen to our heart and two makes this LED flash every time there's a sound. So most of your second, third and fourth years are probably laughing now, thinking how cute. But the two of us are just so excited right now. So how it works is that there is a carbon microphone here, which is like a variable resistor. It changes resistance depending on the sound waves that cause vibrations in it. So look what happens if I turn on, um, you know, tap it. See? Alright, so hard sounds are transducted here to about 1 to 5 millivolts. So this stage right here, what it does is amplifies it to around 2 to 3 volts to drive a uh, headphone. And then here are the filters. So basically we cut off all signals less than 50 hertz because it has main, mains noise and anything um, beyond 200 hertz uh, because the heart sounds, you know, most common frequency is 100 hertz. Yeah, this is basically the signal that we get. Lab dub, lab dub. And then the circuit modulus splits into two. One is to drive a, a headphone, the other one is for the LED. That's to digitalize the circuit. Of course, since we're not using headphones right now, but power speakers, we temporarily change the resistance to reduce the gain. We wish we had access to the oscilloscope right now, but what were shown here are real screenshots that we took earlier. And we have um, op-amps on both stages to make sure that one doesn't affect the other. Let's see. I'm going to use this just to insulate myself with the noise around. Recording this, so I'm nervous, which is why it was a bit faster than expected. And then what we have is we see that you know when it's around one volt, it definitely is hard sound. So that's our threshold. We have a Smith trigger, which kind of digitalizes the circuit into something like this. And then we have an inverting summing amplifier to convert that signal to shrink it down and shift it up to digitalize it to go from zero to five volts. So if you look carefully, every time there's a lub dub a hard sound, you'd see the blue thing going up and down. And that is the job of this fellow over here. So, if I listen to my hard sound again, you'll see the LED blinking. Ooh, it works!